So the Eagles are five and three. The Cowboys go to six and two. The Giants are five and four. The Cowboys go to Green Bay next Sunday. But then they go home for two games against Washington and Oakland. Let's sit it quickly. Game over. One of the 16 Cowboys in Wednesday's post-game report. Coming right up. Why should I trust you? Let me tell you something. Let's go back to December the 28th, 2008. I'm going to do a little personal here on Cowboys Imperial Post Game brought to you by ViewFromTheBench.com. Uh, we'll show the commercial at the end of the show, because this is important. Let's go back to December 28, 2008. Per and we're doing a personal. This was eight days after I flew up to Cincinnati, Ohio, to go tell a girl that, you know, was been, you know, in my life for, what, 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 what year is it, so nine? So, oh, three, like seven years, I don't know. Anyway, she was going over to Iraq, the National Guard, that kind of thing. Went and told her, you know, that I loved her. I mean, you know, heck, she's going into a war zone, so, you know. And plus, she wanted me up there anyway for some, I don't know what reason. But I figured, hey, you know, this has to be for romance. I was denied. I mean, just, like... It was like this. That's what it was like. December the 20th, 2008 was also the night that the Dallas Cowboys lost in monumental fashion to the Baltimore Ravens. The final time in Texas Stadium was a choke. So eight days later, our playoff hopes are still alive. All we have to do is beat the Eagles and we're in. We can dispel this 11-year playoff curse. And we lose 44 to 6. This is the same outfit. In the same style, yes, with the pants tucked in. Go check the video out here. You know, you'll see I had the pants tucked in. Uh, the, 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 the shirt tucked in. I mean, maybe all the, the weirdos can comment on that. But this is the exact same attire that I was wearing on that day when I saw my Dallas Cowboys quit, when I saw them choke, when I saw them lie down, when I saw them become geldings. You heard a little bit of it at the beginning of uh, the show. Ecstasy of gold from uh, the good, the bad, and the ugly. Um, that's what I was plan. That's what's been going through my head the whole 24 hours. That's what I played. I muted the TV. That's what I played the f the, f the first half of the game. That's all I could think about was the Cowboys getting their manhood back, and for me personally, bringing closure to. Them choking and, and making me feel worse when I needed you. I needed you to do good. And you didn't. But you did good tonight. And they, they got their manhood back. I don't uh, feel like taunting. I, 
I don't taunt anyway after wins. I don't think I do. You might bring up a video where I do. The, uh, this, I know I made this whole week about you know, us versus the Eagles and everything, but it was us getting our manhood back, and we did. And the Eagles, to their credit, Eagles fans don't want to hear this. They, they turned it off by now. They didn't even watch the video. But your team is a very good team. And you guys really made this a challenge, and I appreciate that. I really appreciate that. You made us work not only for our, our manhood, you made us work for first place in the division. You Eagles use the Dallas Cowboys franchise as a measuring stick to your own. I tell no lie when I say that Dallas Cowboys fans use the Philadelphia Eagles of this decade as a measuring stick for our teams. And for us to beat you in your house after a 44-6 loss like that in the last time we were there, when everything was on the line, much like it is now, for us to do that truly is an honor. I don't even have anything funny to say. I was going to say stuff about, like, you got to be like St. Thomas Aquinas to figure out the replay rules. I was, Tony Dungy looks creepy behind the desk. They ought to have him call in the action. I don't know, he just doesn't have good TV presence. I don't know why. Um, I was going to make jokes about the NBC shows. I'm too emotional, I can't do this. I feel completed. We did it. You did it. And you did it. You really did. God save the Cowboys.